guys, it's your girl Sky, and I'm back with another reaction video. I got this. I want my fiance to get rid of his five year old daughter, you guys. I'm not even gonna say anything else. Roll the clip. I want my fiance to get rid of his five year old daughter. <laughs> Hello, relationship rules. Please keep me anonymous. I need some advice. My 32-year-old fiance has a five-year-old daughter. Her mother passed away when she was giving birth to her. He has been raising her ever since he lost his wife with the help of his family, of course. I am now in the picture and we're going to get married in 2023 and I'm six months pregnant with his son. I am not the stepmother type, so I know I won't treat his daughter the same way. I will treat our son. Oh my God. To be quite honest, she annoys me. She looks exactly like her mother and she constantly reminds my fiance of his dead wife. And she is very attached to her daddy, which makes me afraid that my son will not be able to bond with his father because of her. Basically, I want to tell my fiance to get rid of her. She can live with his grandparents or we can find a nice couple that wants to adopt a child. Wow. You guys. You guys, did you hear what was being said? Did you hear? Okay. I want my fiance to get rid of his five-year-old daughter. <laughs> she wants <clears throat> her fiance to get rid of his five-year-old daughter. Somebody sound the freaking alarm. Somebody please go rescue that man and his daughter. What on earth is wrong with people? How the heck can you sit? You are this jealous of a child and her father's relationship. If anything, that should make you love that man more. Talking about she annoying. She remind him of his dead wife and she's attached to her dad. That is a great thing. There are too many little girls out here who don't even have their fathers. And you sit up here talking about you trying to take this little girl away from hers because you think that he can't give the same love to your child. If he's a great father, a great man, and you're willing to marry him, then don't you think that he's able to give that exact same love to his other child? It doesn't make any sense. Like, honestly, situations like this make me think that this has to be a troll. Like, I just can't bring myself to believe people like this exist. Like, this is a troll. This person's got to be trolling. They got to be trolling because this is the dumbest crap I've ever heard. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. <clears throat> and why are you with this man? You, you got into a relationship with this man knowing full well he had a child knowing full well he had a child in the entire time i don't know how long y'all have been dating i don't know if she said it in there or not i was too freaking confused by the other bull crap that she was saying but they i'm gonna i'm gonna assume that they've been together for a good amount of time since they're gonna be getting married in the next year <clears throat> okay so you've been with him this entire time and you mean to tell me this whole time you've had an issue with his child and you haven't said anything to let him know that this is your, these are your little motives. Your little evil back, like your little evil background. And he just, he just been with you this whole time thinking everything okay. No, there's no way. There's no way. This is scary as crap. Like just to think about somebody having this type of hate towards your child. And, and who knows if he's been leaving her around him or anything. And if she's been doing crap to this poor child. Like ain't no telling what the heck is going If this is real, somebody like I know somebody know who this is. There's no way that the, if you sit back. And you know this woman personally. And you know that she has a problem with this little girl. And you're not saying anything about it. You are no better than her. You're disgusting too. 
you're going to sit back and allow this, this child to grow up in an abusive environment. Lord and Lord, God forbid, you know, he leaves her one day and she really does something like somebody needs to call this person out and get the, let this man know what really is going on so he can get him and his child up out of there. Get Jesus, get them up out of there. Cause this is ridiculous. It's completely ridiculous. I'm just, I'm dumbfounded. I'm dumbfounded by it. <clears throat> I have a stepdaughter. I, like, I love, I could not imagine feeling that way towards a child. I love my stepdaughter just like I love my son. Like, the, and, and for anybody to have this type of mentality, I, I just, mm-hmm. There ain't ain't much I can really say about it besides please send help. Somebody send help, <laughs> please. But y'all know, let me know what y'all think down in the comments because this video is, is definitely very short, sweet, and to the point. But I mean, it speaks for itself, you guys. So let me know what you think down in the comments. Thank you guys for tuning in again and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.